Hey everybody, this is Way to Fail, back with more Starbound, where after a little bit of dumping my inventory into some new chests, because that is my strategy, we do actually have a quest that is complete. I do have a full set of armor, and I'll get coordinates to fight a robo-mech of some kind, but we're not doing that yet. I still want to... I feel like I can get a little bit more mileage out of this just by uh, trying to explore just a little bit more. Like I said, I want to get a little bit of a better weapon. And it's Frigid Ocean, so I probably should have noticed that ahead of time. Do we have any other really interesting, dangerous places here? We have Risky, Dangerous, Ice Snow, Temperature, Temperature, Temperature Dangerously Low, Ice Oceans, Ice and Snow. So yeah, it's what do you know, around a frozen star, we have a Harmless Moon and some other things. So let's go to the planet we know and see if we can kill enough things to actually... Get, get some good weapons to drop. Like I said, this was the beautiful range assassin was a drop. I can do better than the demonic meat hunker. So let's go ahead and finish resting in the tent here real quick. I thought I was full health. But yeah, this is... I do have, like I said before, I did upgrade to the uh, rubium armor. Not so much because I was trying to pick something in particular. It's just what I found more. And it just turns out that it has... A ton of energy, so I get to wear some bone saw gear, which is pretty nice. So let's beam to the planet. What we found before was to the left, to the left. So we're just gonna shoot anything that gets in our way. You're in our way. The rate of fire for this is kind of dismal, but but otherwise we do have our fun dramatic music for uh, this area. But let's hear one. Nope. There we go. Not bad. And like I said, there's always this planet if I need to explore and get something else from here as well. So, other nice thing is that because I have a ton of energy reserves, I can speed dash like this all day. Not exactly all day, but I think my energy recharge should still be alright. So, we'll go melee here just while we're. Yeah, my energy charge is actually phenomenal. Alright. So I can bypass a lot of threats, or shoot him in the face. Shoot him in the face. Raw steak too, which is pretty cute. So nice snowstorm. Haha, -ha, nice is kind of a pun. All right. Hello, fortress, my old friend. Did everybody just clear out? No, it did actually save who I killed. All right. So if I say give me something to kill and I want to shoot over here, one unfortunate thing is that this is a very glitchy area. Not glitchy, but laggy. So I should have a lot more health to take these guys on with. Should be the operative word here. More important thing is I'm not taking nearly as much damage. So if we can just get some good items instead of like a little tickler. Yeah, love that recharge. I don't think they patched in anything regarding the recharge. Pretty sure it's just how it is. So you're trying to melee me. That's fun. And you gave me a stim pack. Alright. What do you got for me? Leave this place now, you'll be forced to take action. That's fine, take action. I'm gonna beat you in the face. Once again. Trying to keep a track of, did I get any good drops here? So far, not really. It used to be these things drop weapons just all the time. Okay. Robo wheelchair, apparently not a threat. And Sniper McSniperson is going to just... Glory of the Big Ape. Wow. My shots are either off or I'm just getting in a knife fight with me and that's not a good idea. Alright. You're just a researcher. You're not supposed to be able to be a threat. Alright. And that's actually an item. Maybe? No, it's a chair. That's a zombie monkey. There's always one. And you want to shoot me now. It's, it's just great. You upgrade your armor and you can just face tank everything. 
So let's see here. I can even just fire on you. You're not... Hey, that was an apex. That looked like a person. Alright, so 50 pixels, 50 pixels. Gonna be pretty disappointed if I don't get any items from here, but... It may not be until the... For science! That's funny. It may not be until the very top where we have some potential for gear. I don't know. But I feel like they should have sounded the alarms or something by now. You have a lot of health. You also are terrible at aiming. Okay, only stem packs. Try and wait. Okay, one at a time. Maybe this next one will have something good. Oh. Okay, here comes the robo. Oh, it's actually one in a wheelchair with a little laser with its brain exposed. Kind of cute. And I'm not sure what that terminal's supposed to be. But it might be important. I'm a little irritated because I wanted an item. Oh, wow. Hello. I didn't know I was opening a door there. Should actually watch my health here. Alright. Thank you for using your tickle ray. That'll do. So what do we got here? That's just a computer. That just opens a door. That's like the biggest waste of space. Well, did I get anything? I got stem packs, and somewhere along the way I got a uh, stem spawner. So I guess that's the loot from there. That's that's something for the ship. Not quite what I was looking for, but it's all good. Alright. So if we go out this way, can we exit this way? We can. They're expecting me to really come in from the other direction. They should know better. It's always left or right. Alright, so late nights. And more ores. Guess they're expecting me to craft some weapons by now. Which I guess is not a huge surprise. Yeah, maybe I will actually. If my gun is stronger then what else I could be taking on then maybe I should, maybe it would behoove me to actually go ahead and go to the outpost and see what robo mech I could be fighting or something I think that's what the quest said yeah new new oh did they say fight it always ends up being a fight maybe chucklefish will uh, change the quests a little later to where it's not just fighting sometimes you have to save the something or other so it's your treasure chest ice chest who wants an ice block on an ice planet seriously guys I mean, you just gotta you gotta figure this out why are you putting ice in a freaking chest okay I don't think you're aggressive to me but we're gonna oh you're definitely aggressive to me, robot. Yeah. And what was that? That was a circuit board. That is, I believe, actually a fairly important nothing. Well, you know, it may be good for actually crafting a tech card later, but those things are not supposed to be sitting out here by themselves. Here we go. Okay, so you have a little shield. That's that's why you didn't have much. All right. Good. Okay, so we have other places that we can explore here. So here is a frozen base. You have a shield. You didn't use the shield, but you dropped the shield. Alright, so anything else here? No, I think, I think the most important place is to go down, down, down. So, nice when we have two dungeons here all at once. And what kind of shield was that? Nose, dagger, flector. Yeah. What do we got down here? We got lots of people and lots of robots. I'm gonna feel right at home. Oh look, it's like that thing from the Jetsons. And I'm gonna kill it. 
And it's a Roomba. Probably if I step on it, it'll explode or something mean. There's another circuit board. I feel like I, I, I feel like I remember that I could do something with circuit boards. There we go. Hopefully, between last place and this place, we'll actually find an item that works. Shoot it down. Nothing here. You have a gun. You're gonna chase me with a knife, so. Yeah, the USM uh, messages are all very inspirational. I cannot actually shoot that Roomba. There we go. My aim is true, except for just then. That's funny. Alright, so what I get here? Probably a med pack. Yeah. Alright, so we have some riot gear. Anything in the cola box? Not really. Okay, so we're gonna have to kite, kite, kite. I really like having all this energy at the tip of my hand here. Once again, I remember, I want to say if I step on those guys, they explode in a pretty nasty way. Oh, actual food, not rotten food. That's good. Let's actually get our correct equipment here. Now, what do we got down here? Some of these things used to have like a little treasure pinata area at the end. Okay, so bye-bye Jetson's robot. I love how that guy's like, oh, did you just get shot, little robot? We're not going to do anything about it. All right. At least I can get these guys to range. And I actually ran out of bullets that time, which is a little odd. What's that? I don't know what that is. Let's go down here first. So you have not developed the technology to jump. So you're just gonna eat bullets. I am your death, stranger. Well, good. Nice to meet you. I cannot aim to save my life. Okay, you're my death. You just don't happen to have ranged weaponry here in this distant future where we have star travel in a game like Starbound. Still, the lag is real. Yeah, this is really interesting. Yet I'm recording at 60 frames per second. It seems like uh, you'll get to see the lag just as nice as I. Okay, there's a water cooler down there. One shot, one kill. So many circuit boards. It's like we have some people who just really want to be friends with robots. I'm going to take that water cooler. I feel like I need one of those on the ship. At least as a memento to the massacre that I have just lain. Okay, you can't actually hit me. Is he trying to punch me? That's cute. So what else do we got down here? Not a lot. I mean, I feel like... If I'm not just going to get any equipment drops from any of these things, then there's not really much purpose for me in going through here. I know it's a little bit RNG based. But I can be a little disappointed, perhaps. Maybe you have what I'm looking for. Person with pointy thing with a shield. Who's actually putting my life in a little bit of danger. Hmm. Not for long. Alright. I actually did not mean to hop down there, but I'll take it. Basic... Oh, let's take the oven. Oven and the fridge, apparently. Okay. Should I get the toilet while I'm at it? Yeah, there's not too much more down here. Robots, assemble! Oh my god, you can actually go upstairs. Oh my god, you actually shot me! Oh my god! Alright. What are you? You're just a terminal. And you are a dead end. Oh, that's disappointing. But hey, at least we uh, blew through another 
dungeon-ish thing, and I don't know if there's a lot in the way of, uh, what do we call it? Like, secrets in here? I think it's just literally a uh, little base. So you know what? Screw it. Let's just go to the... Uh, let's see what there is to see and see if I do actually need to upgrade my equipment a little bit more. Let's go to the outpost. Like I said, I probably do. But considering the only thing that dropped was some wire and a shield, let's at least advance our quest line a little bit. Still fun, interesting, good to bang things around. Let's see what we got on this end. FTL activating. And once again, if if anything, jumping jump complete. Okay, so they, they changed how that works. A little bit. Alright, so here we go. My inventory is a lot of stim packs. I never remember what the stim packs do. We'll just go ahead and dump some of them in here. Don't get me wrong, I know they're I know they're a valuable asset. Where did I put my little special ores? Here's where some of them went. Alright, and what's that? Laser diode. It's a laser diode. Probably useful. Let's outpost it. And outpost, yay! Something, something. We're almost through the uh, gears of stuff. I don't know if anyone else has any quests for me right now. There are a few quests that I could potentially do to upgrade my hull just a little bit more. But we're going to hold off on that for the time being because I think we have something pretty important right here from Mr. Penguin. Yay! Uh, my friend is a science type, so he'll no doubt reward you for your troubles. Yay! And we have a mission that has been obtained. Details in your ship's computer. So I'm coordinates for weapon test tonight. I can get something out of help out, so there we go. We now have another quest. Mechanical testing. I have coordinates to weapon testing site. I can get something out of it if I help out. Yeah, probably your own death, to be honest. I mean, let's be honest here. All these missions so far have been like, we're going to send you a place where you'll die. How why is this gonna be any different? All right, let's at least look at our inventory. Make sure we're not going to drop anything that's super valuable, which we're actually on the verge of right now. Uh, let's let's put you in there. All right, I don't think there's too much else that I care too much about. Cool. You know what? It's been nice knowing y'all. Let's uh, go to the weapon testing site. Look, there's a penguin on the cover. Surely nothing can go wrong. The last time we went to a penguin place, it was uh, lovely. And here we go. Look, they, they even have a tent. This is almost like where I was previously. Alright, so we have a tent, we have a campfire. If this is what I think it is, I remember a Reddit post where you can cheese this with a grappling hook. But for now, we're just going to zoom forward, and it looks like it's another dungeon. Some way, shape, or form. Is there anything worthwhile over here? No. Alright, cool. As long as we have that out of the way. Are you ready for a fight? Actually got a 200 damage shield. And a... Uh, I want to actually move that to... There. So I have two shields if needed and I have a gun. What could possibly go wrong? Other than everything. So what's in this crate? Nothing. What's in this crate? Nothing. And... Well... I guess this is where we fight. Fire the missiles. Oh good, they're seeking missiles. And they too shot me. So I assume anything we do with that, we're going to need a shield for the missiles. Oh no, I lost pixels. Alright, well, let's do it again. We've had some good fights and everything, but now I know I am not immortal. And that is, I guess, healthy to know. 
Well, I'm curious with that post that said you can totally cheese this guy by hanging up here and just shooting at him. I guess he doesn't engage. So let's see here. Fist punch. And missile bombard. Wow, okay. Of course I have to straight up dodge. That's good to know. Dodge, dip, duck, what? Not one, not that. Well, I guess it may be a time to go back to the drawing board for some of this. But at least if we can dodge some of the missiles, we know now that the missiles are by far the biggest threat. I don't know if there's like a tech I need to get for like phasing out or disappearing. Or blinking through some of it. So we'll at least give it a few shots. Large wouldn't great. You're nothing. Alright, so one. That's not what we want to do. Okay, so you know what? At one point I was apparently good at dodging missiles, but that first missile's getting me every time. Deploy. We'll try this one more time. I said, I have the I have the right gear for it. It's just getting through that first missile barrage. Because they will turn on you. You want them to hit the wall. I mean, what am, what am I going to lose except pixels, right? There we go. Ooh, I was way too close. Oh! Haha! -ha! Well, you know what? The good news is I got a little bit of a pattern. The bad news is I don't think I actually did any substantive damage to him. Let's try one more time. So if we stay on the wall... And I am doing this blind. I haven't looked anything up on the boss. Although I've died enough and lost enough pixels to where I feel like I can now. Pixels still don't really seem to have too much of a use. I hope that changes. Okay, we're not going to get greedy here. Okay. Oh, that was my mistake. I dashed one too many times. Alright. We are going to do this one more time. I feel like I've got this guy. I feel like I want to at least get through this first phase. And I guess I could be using a refinery to hide my pixels and change them into items or something, but if there's something I need pixels for later, oops, I'll get them again at some point. Once again though, it's just interesting to me. What is my total health? 200. Alright. I'm supposedly wearing the high health armor too, so. Oh, that's dumb. I just ran into the boss that time. I, I keep saying I'm going to do it one more time. I'm really going to do it one more time here. One more time. I mean, I did some damage to him. And it doesn't seem like the missile stuff's so bad. I've just got to focus on dodging. Get one shot or two shots in and dodge. Because we know that the missiles will guard, break, and destroy you. Okay, so back against this wall. Probably making this way too complicated for myself. Yeah, I shouldn't have double jumped there. Okay, one more time, and then I'm going to have to call this a video. Hey, not bad, right? Give it a few goes, lose 90% of my pixels. It's fun! 
It's fun. That's what these bosses are for, just to actually be difficult. This is part of the fun discovery portion of the game. Where he does one punch, and then if I go all the way over here... Okay. Whoa, that's some serious lag. Uh-oh. Oh, okay. Double jump is the devil here. I'm just gonna have to practice a little bit and see if I can get a pattern. So sorry for the disappointment. I'm sure some of you are screaming at the screen like, "Do this instead!" And I'm sure it's plainly obvious. Like I said, I may have some better text for that, like uh, energy dash, ground smash, rocket jump. I think I have one tech card right now, but eh. You know what? That's it for now. I'm gonna call this a video. This is way to fail. Maybe a little bit shorter. I actually don't know where we are on time. But hey, boss, new stuff. May try and go to another planet to get some equipment. Just depends. I hope you enjoyed it. See you next time.